It's all new at Tennessee, where a new coaching staff has to decide on a new quarterback. Rising junior Justin Worley is the only one on the roster who's taken a college snap, having played behind Tyler Bray the past two years and starting three games as a freshman after Bray had been hurt. Nathan Peterman will be a redshirt freshman, and both are getting an equal shot. What's this like for you? Well, last year, you know, they didn't actually explicitly tell me, you know, it was a red shirt until maybe in the middle of the season. But if injuries were to happen, you know, I needed to be ready to play. Just having the opportunity to compete and push each other and make each other better is, I mean, it's exciting to, to have this opportunity. I know people always say freshmen can come in and lead as well, but definitely being around these guys for three years and even the new guys helping them come in and transition, that helps. I do think Justin Worley has benefit of playing as a true freshman. He can perform all the passes, the deep ball, intermediate throws, or also the, the short throws. Uh, Nate is an individual who's extremely cerebral, very intelligent, can perform all the throws, accurate. He's probably a little more quicker with his feet to be able to make plays. I love the approach that both those guys have taken. They come every day to work. They, they, they want to be sponges. They want to absorb everything we as coaches have to say. They want to learn the ins and outs of the offense. A strength for each may have to be patience because this competition could go deep into fall camp. Well, we do have a plan in place, and I don't really think, uh, you know, it really is going to benefit for us to come out right now and name a starter. How badly do you want to win that job? Uh, I mean, everybody wants to play, and uh, just having this opportunity to to show what I, I can do. I think just as bad as the other guy, you know, it, I think everybody wants to be the starter. That's what you grew up wanting to be. That's your dream. So just as bad as the other guy. And some dreams create sleepless nights. I'm Paul Crane for SEC Tonight. Coming up on SEC Tonight, the field of 68 is set. Did the SEC get dissed or what it deserves? And can the league make noise in the dance? Spring football in Fayetteville, the latest on Arkansas's quarterback duel. And playing hardball in Nashville, just how good are the high-flying Commodores? Johnny Football set to show his stuff. Derek goes one-on-one -on -one with Tennessee's Butch Jones. Which conference is second best? Could it be the Pac-12? We check out the spring practices at Alabama, Georgia, Florida, and FSU. Rackley, Ackerman, Barnhart, and Neal suit up for Talkin' Football, presented by Golden Flake. 